A terminally ill Dickinson girl gets a princess parade she will never forget. Mm -hmm. Certainly beautiful. As Fox 26's Chris Stipe shows us, it was quite a day for the five-year-old. Lining up outside Claire Langford's Dickinson house and winding through the streets of her neighborhood. It is an absolute dream. Hundreds of people who mostly don't even know the five-year-old. Anytime someone is in need, this community comes together. But love and support her all the same. She deserves it. If anyone deserves it, she does. Little Claire has terminal cancer, but still has dreams of being a princess. She's a girl. That's why she loves princesses. Glitter and fancy dresses and fancy hair. On this day, she became one, a complete and total surprise, joining the likes of Belle, Cinderella, and Snow White. What do you think about all these princesses for you? I like it. You like it? And picking her up at their front door, the only Prince Charming she's ever known, her dad. Well, you take one day at a time, and you remain thankful for each day that you have, and that's my advice to anyone is... Um, be thankful for your family members because life can change in a heartbeat. What was your reaction when you opened your door and you saw your daddy, your Prince Charming there? I, his name is actually Daddy. <laughs> his name is actually Dad. You're a sweetheart. <laughs> Their horse-drawn carriage circled the subdivision over and over again to the cheers and smiles of so many new friends, people who took the time to care. People know my child's name and they know her story and they know her face and her smile and her spirit and that is the blessing through all of this is that people know who my child is who's a loving caring person well, there are hundreds and hundreds of people here and they're all here for you what would you want to say to them I really like them you really like them Claire doesn't have much time left after getting a clean bill of health last summer, just last month, doctors found five tumors on her lungs and lymph nodes. That's why the family friends who organized this princess parade had to act fast. It makes me sad. I was thinking today I wanted to take her to Disney on ice, and um, that's in April, so might not be, might not be here. There we go. But she's here right now on this magical day when a beautiful girl named Claire Langford brought out the best in so many. She was always happy and she was always thankful. And if that little girl can have that spirit, then we can all be happy and thankful and grateful for everything we have. And what a great experience for everybody there. Absolutely. Princess Claire is certainly teaching mm -hmm. everyone a lesson about life and how valuable it is. And, and to hear that... Um, she may not make it to mm. Disney on Ice, which is just a few weeks away in April. Precious little girl.